according to the fulkerson's rule what is the correct event numbers corresponding to the events a b c d e f g h of the network as shown in the figure so network is given to us so network is given to us we have to do the numbering of this events as fulkerson's rule according to fulkerson's rules number the initial event as 1 initial event will have only outgoing arrows in it so this is the network which is given to us so to do the numbering of the events of this network as per full consent rule so as per full consent rules number the initial event as 1 so 1 remove all the outgoing arrows new initial events will be formed initial events are those which are only having outgoing arrows so it is having incoming arrow it is not an initial event so new initial event number this event sequentially so 2 remove all the outgoing arrows new initial events will be formed new initial events are those which are having only outgoing arrows so only outgoing arrows this is having an incoming arrow from both the sides so two new initial events are formed so two new initial events are formed so let us suppose this is 3 this is 4 so two new initial events are formed remove all the outgoing arrows so new initial events are formed new initial events are formed this is 5 remove all the outgoing arrows new initial event is formed this is 6 remove all the outgoing arrows number the initial event sequentially 7 so as per fulkerson's rules numbering will be done by this so numbering is done by this so correct option so correct option for this is a1 so a1 b b2 B two, so B two, then we have C, C four, C four, then we have D, then we have D, D five, D five, then we have F, F, F three, then we have G. Numbering of G is six. Numbering of G is six. Then we have E. Numbering of E is seven. So correct option is C.